and we took off the gambella. We had no idea where we were going. But it's just through prayer and faith, the Lord lead us. And He's faithful in that. Uh, he has been for the past, our, our whole lives. Um, so it's just amazing to see where He's leading us. Expectations were just basically we wanted to make contact. We wanted to make contact with Scar's sister uh, initially, just wanted to make sure she knew that we existed and that he was with us and well taken care of and loved. And from there, we really didn't know what to expect. Well, the first day was a little nerve wracking because we couldn't find her and we got into Gambella pretty late and so it was getting dark and so we had to go to a couple houses you know, to communicate with people to figure out where she was. Um, we eventually did find out the house that she used to live at um, so that was a little crazy because I thought we were going to see her and then all of a sudden somebody else lived there but somebody told us that they knew where she was. So at that point we had to kind of end the search because it was already getting dark um, and so we started up the next morning. Um, someone knew exactly where she was, that she had moved from being with her aunt to her maternal grandfather and basically we went straight there in the morning and it was just really exciting to see her. She had the same eyes as Scar and it was just so sweet and amazing to see her and just to give her a hug and um, just know that she existed. She was really there right in front of us. I think just a continuation of what started two years ago where we sent uh, Busy to go find her um, and from that all we had was a picture and so from that God just planted our hearts to be able to go find her um, and we accomplished that. And so it was, it was pretty amazing. Our whole mission here was just to be able to find her and to at least start, initiate the relationship with her mm -hmm. and let her know who we are, where we are, um, that we've got her brother and he's loved and taken care of and we want to be able to just, however we can, help minister to her and to her family. And so I felt like in my heart, for me to not pursue that would just be a disservice to Scarborough in the future because he can know his sister. If he wants that opportunity, we at least can have contact and communication with her. If he ever questions, I want to know her or see her. And so now we feel like he has that avenue to do that in the future.